Tom Truitt. I am an instructor in the deck department at the school here and conduct training at all levels of our deck seamanship, which include material handling and cargo handling of goods. At the Seafarers International Union, Harry Lumberg School of Seamanship, our primary mission is to take young people that want to come into the maritime industry, just starting out, no license, uh, no kind of training, and we train them for the maritime industry to go out and sail. When they leave here, they're gonna be certified in many different areas, and one of those is actually working with the cranes. We can go anywhere from eight students up to 24 students at a time. On the simulator, we primarily do our training with the Haglin crane, but we also do training with the Lee Bear crane as well. Switching from Haglin and the Lee Bear cranes is very easy. You're able to stop one entire scenario, unplug, and change out the controllers in a matter of a couple of minutes. It doesn't take that long to change those out and be ready for your next type of scenario. We also tried out the RTG and just the same thing. Quick change out, input the new scenario, and you're going right back to work. The whole system is very user friendly. Unlike a lot of simulators that we've worked with before, it's pretty much a single push button start. It starts up and it's ready to use. The same thing when you get ready to shut down, a single button shut down and everything goes down and it's good for the day. There's not a whole series of, uh, of setup to do. Working with the staff has really been a great benefit. They sat down with us, they talked about how the program worked, they walked through each of the processes and then took time and trained us as instructors how to set the scenarios up for what we want to do, how we can vary it, how we can input faults, and then sat and watched and observed us to go through different scenarios, do scenario designing, and create something that is realistic for our use. It made sure that it worked. 